Hey, this is Mitch Eilerman with RV Wholesalers. Uh, today we're going to do a walk around on a 2022 Rockwood Mini Light 2509S. Uh, this is the number one seller in the Mini Light series. Uh, I think the biggest features and the best features of the unit is you're going to have a double over double bunk beds, a single slide, Murphy bed up front. Um, you're, you're coming in just over 5,000 pounds on your dry weight at 5,300 pounds. Total length is under 26 foot at 25 foot 11 inches, um, and that's total length including tongue. Uh, the best features about Rockwood is, in my opinion, it's, it's the best product on the market. It's the number one seller that we have, um, not only the floor plan, but the, but the line in general. They've, they've got multiple different models. Uh, this particular model being the 2509S is, um, you know, it's got an outside kitchen. You've got two exteriors to choose from. You've got a charcoal front end, or you can get a white exterior. You've got two wood colors to choose from as far as the autumn wood, which will be a little bit darker. And then they also have a Newport ash cabinetry, which is going to be a little lighter yeah, as far as your cabinet color goes. And then the two options as far as your furniture color goes is you've got stone, which is a little, maybe a little bit lighter gray. And then they have a chocolate, which is, which is a, um, like a lighter brown color. Um, you know, you've got a 190 watt solar panel, comes standard on the roof of the unit. Uh, it does come standard now with a residential 12 volt refrigerator, so you've got a lot of bit bigger refrigerator. Not a ton of options, you know, you can get maybe like a bigger air conditioner or if you wanted to get power jacks instead of crank down jacks on your corner, it does come with a standard power uh, front jack. Um, feature wise, you're just jam packed with different features, you know, um, as far as quality goes, you're fully vacuum bonded, six side aluminum frame construction. You've got plywood flooring. Um, you've got the nicer amenities, nicer uh, as far as appliances. All in all, I mean, yes, it's going to be as far as a price point more towards the higher end, but you're also going to get the highest end quality as well. Hey, my name is Mitch Eilerman with RV Wholesalers. Today, I'm going to do a walk around on a 2022 Rockwood Mini Light. The model's a 2509S, which is the number one seller. Uh, just starting up front, Look how aggressive your front end is. This is the standard exterior. Uh, I call it more like a charcoal front end. Um, it does have the tan sidewalls, a little bit lighter tan sidewalls. You can get a lighter um, white exterior if you wanted to, so that's an option. Um, just depends on each customer, so when ordering it for you, we can do either option there. Um, Rock was gonna be standard with a lot of features, and in my opinion, this is gonna be the best product on the market. Uh, and personally, I, I like it the best. I, I know it really well. Um, I think their quality is good. It's a true six side aluminum frame construction, fully backing bonded, block foam insulation, which is your best build. Um, you're gonna notice you've got two 30 pound propane tanks on the front. You will have a power tongue jack, and then it comes with a battery box where you can fit two batteries in there as well. Uh, moving on to the, to the door side of the unit, as we come over, uh, this is uh, for power jacks for your corner jacks. Now, that's an option. Otherwise, it's going to come standard with uh, four crank down jacks or bring your drill. So you do have the option to get it with power or just regular um, crank down jacks. Um, it does have um, solar panel prep or, or solar prep for um, go power. This also comes standard with a um, 190 watt solar panel and residential fridge. And then there's going to be an option to go with a gas and electric fridge for, the, for those that really want a gas and electric fridge. And then you wouldn't have a solar panel um, you, and you would have a, a, a regular um, gas or electric refrigerator in that aspect. But the standard comes the bigger 12 volt residential and then 190 watt solar panel standard on the roof with an option to get a second 190 watt solar panel as well. So that is an option that they, they're doing this year in the 2022 models. Moving over here, you're going to say you have some storage here. Um, this is not like a huge big opening here just because you've got a Murphy bed, but you still have a ton of storage as you get into there. There. We'll keep moving. They do have friction hinged doors, so you can take it, you can slam it. You don't have to worry about the wind catching it and slamming it into the side of your unit every time. Um, real quick, while we're right here, they do a great job as far as giving you a little spot to get all the big features. Um, this does come standard with your Dexter axles. Um, it does have a tire pressure monitoring system, so when you're going down the road, 
you'll you'll have a system that will tell you a little um, almost like a little screen thing that'll tell you if you're rapidly losing air slowly losing air um, so that or if you're getting too hot where maybe a bright brakes hung up or something so that comes standard um, backup camera prep comes standard it is a fully laminated walkable roof aluminum wheels uh, you do have uh, Goodyear tires that come standard on the unit as well. Uh, one, one thing that a lot of people don't realize that's, that's a really nice feature is these steps, right? So a lot of, pretty much all the RV manufacturers out there right now give you uh, solid steps, but they don't, what, what the problem with it is, is they're heavy. They're heavy to pull up in. You'll notice I can pick this up with one finger right there's a strut right on the inside of this door that allows this to go right up and then they give you a nice handle so that's really been really nice for customers just because it's very easy to put in and out you'll notice on the steps they do have the little little uh, push things here so like the old ones you used to have to try to line up the pin every time this you just adjust it here so you can just push it here and that allows it to adjust out and bring those legs out without having to line up a pin every time. That's one big plus that they've changed on their steps uh, besides having the, uh, the nicer um, strut as well. We'll keep moving down here. It does have frameless windows. You do have your gas and electric hot water heater, uh, power awning with LED lights. Your TV comes standard with the unit and the TV can be moved out on the bracket and then it just slides right onto here plug in right here to your cable jacks and everything else. Um, it does come standard with a little table for the exterior uh, as well as a griddle. So um, I believe it's a suburban griddle. I believe that's what they're using. Uh, so like a little, like almost like a Blackstone or just a, just a different brand name. So nice little cooktop with a table and that all comes standard as well. We'll keep moving back a little bit. Besides the griddle, you have an outside kitchen. So you're gonna have a fridge and then you're gonna have a two burner cooktop as well. Um, it does have a spot for you know, water. You have a quick disconnect for water with hot and cold with a little sprayer. So you'll still have water access to back here for you know, cleaning anything off, dishes, dogs, sandy feet, everything like that. So we'll keep moving back. <clears throat> Once you get to the rear of the coach, it comes standard with your uh, rear ladder, full walk on roof. It uh, does come with backup camera prep, spare tire. And then you'll notice they're one about the few that puts a two inch receiver on the back. So you, if you got little racks and everything like that, you can put the slide those right in there and that's all ready to the frame. We'll move over to the driver's side of the unit. As we come over, you're gonna see you've got a detachable power cord does have a hot and wool, hot and cold outside shower. So you've actually got two spots here uh, for water. And you've got it right there by your outside kitchen. And then you'll have another one right here for your outside shower as well. It does come with black tank flush standard. It also comes with a winterization outlet and then your fresh water intake and then a cable and satellite jacks as well. we'll keep moving down a little bit. You notice you're gonna have storage underneath your U-shaped dinette. As you look down, you'll notice that you see aluminum framing. That's another big plus they do. Even underneath all their dinettes and everything, that's all gonna be aluminum framing, not the cheaper wood. This is going to just be another storage department that's tall, so it goes right behind the cabinets on the inside, so fishing poles and everything there. Keep coming down, now we're on the other side here of your storage that goes through. This was the little table I was talking to you about earlier that slides on the side besides the griddle. That is a nicer material. It's not gonna warp, it's not gonna um, absorb moisture and everything else like a lot of the cheaper ones. And that, that slides on that uh, cooking station on the other side. It does have nice magnet latches to hold up your doors. That's really nice. Uh, you've got docking lights up front. So as you come up front here, I'll show you that you got a cool little light. So as you can see, it's off now. And then we will flip that on. There's your docking light so you can see real good up here. Fresh water fill is also located up here. Next, we'll go ahead and move on into the inside. Okay, moving on the inside here. Um, first off, we'll go over your couple different color options, right? So this is going to be the autumn wood, which is a little bit darker um, cabinet. Uh, 
This does have a stone furniture color as well, which is a little bit lighter gray. You can also get a Newport ash, which is going to be a lot lighter of a cabinet. And then they also make a chocolate furniture option where this furniture will be more of like a lighter brown color versus the like a lighter gray color. So you got a couple options there as far as your uh, colors on the interior cabinet color and then also your furniture color you've got a couple options there uh, one thing that's really cool about this setup is it is a murphy bed right so as we come in you get it we're right now we're in the position where you're, you're not using your bed it does have a cool little cup holder that comes over right here so you can put your cup cups and stuff right there that'll fold back up it does come standard with each side with two foot rests uh, one thing with these footrests is when you go to, there's no like lever or something like that to, to put it back down. So when you go to put it up, all you do is pull back with your heels just to tear and that releases it and that closes it right up. Uh, you do have the nicer uh, roller shades that come standard now. Uh, they did a cool new, new balance this year in the 2022s, a little bit lighter, matches the theme really good with everything on, on both colors and everything there. Um, you did have hanging storage on both sides as well as a little drawer on both slides for, um, you know, all your, all your hanging clothes, socks, and all your different accessories there. Um, let me stand up here and I'm gonna show you how the Murphy bed comes down because it's really simple and easy. First thing that we do when you're doing this is I always unlatch here. So you got a latch on each side. So I unlatch there, I'll unlatch here, good there. And then I always, there's a little handle right here, a little strap I should say, you pull that, that lays that flat. And then all you do is pull this and it just comes right down. There you go, that simple, that easy, that quick. It is a nicer mattress, it's not a fold up mattress. They give you these straps to keep your bedding, you know, from falling and getting jammed up and having to remake it every time, so that's nice. You'll notice you've got a huge panoramic window up front, so as the blind goes up, you'll be able to see out front really easy. Um, a lot of people like, to, like sitting up there because you can actually, when you're, you know, put that up at night, a lot of times you can see you know the stars and, and it makes you feel like you're more outside and everything to simply put this up there's going to be a little black knob right here you pull that right towards you let go of it and then that goes straight up once you get that up go ahead and put your sofa back up push your, pull your pin back through on each side again and then you've got up and down so literally 20 seconds to do that max. So that's that's a great feature that they have and that's why you can get such a compact model with all the space and not being real long and heavy. Okay, now we're gonna move over to the kitchen. So you'll notice you've got a nicer, like almost like a solid surface material countertop. So it is a lot nicer countertop. It does have a high rise residential faucet. Does have two sink covers, right? One is cut out a little bit so you can put different dishes into there for drying purpose. Once you take them both off, you do have an undermount stainless steel sink, and it does have a split sink, not just one bowl. It is split with, you know, um, I like that for, especially when doing dishes, you can wash and then you can bring everything over here, rinse it. To me, that's just sort of what I'm used to. It, and then that's what they do standard. Uh, you'll notice up above, you're gonna have your TV location that is on a swing. So that will pull out, swing to your front, swing to your side. And again, when we're on the outside, this does come off and you can hang it on the outside underneath the, the awning. If you wanna watch a game or a movie at night, you could do that. Uh, one thing that's cool here is this has a two 110 plugs and then also has USB charging points so that you, if you got you know crock pot going and different things, you've got plugs right there. Then you just push this little red button that goes down and then it's completely out of the way. Gives you, give you more counter space and it looks really clean. Uh, it does come standard with a three burner cooktop with a, with a larger oven. It does have nice backlighting for your lights. You'll notice that they do a bigger oven compared. Most ovens are gonna be a lot smaller. They don't have as, as much height. So you can't cook a lot of things in there if they're, if they're a little bit taller. It's one thing they do standard as well. It does have a cool countertop extension right here. Give you extra counter stop space. That's a nice feature up top. It has your um, fan and then your light and then your microwave as well. 
This particular one does have the gas and electric refrigerator. So let me show you what the differences are there. When you go with a gas and electric refrigerator, which is not standard, it will have a wood panel front, sort of looks like your cabinets. The standard fridge is always going to have a, it'll be stainless steel, it's going to be taller, and it will be 12 volt. So like this particular unit, it will not have a solar panel on it unless they spec it that way because it doesn't come standard when you go into this fridge. If you do have a 12 volt um, refrigerator with the stainless steel, it will come with 190 watt solar panel standard. Uh, you'll notice down below here, you do have more cabinets. Uh, you do also have a little spot right here for like your, your washcloths and everything. It's like a plastic so it doesn't absorb moisture. And then you've got full ball bearing door glides and you've got three of those down below there as well. Okay, moving over to the slide out. One thing you'll notice is it does have a big U-shaped dinette, but it has a huge storage here, right? And these are individual shelves. Um, so if you wanna put something taller in there, these shelves can come in and out and you can, you can mess with that, give you more height and everything. So that's nice to have. It gives you a ton of storage there. You notice as you move over, you've got a nice U-shaped dinette. It does have a nicer table, but does have big posts. So they use a nicer table that doesn't have big posts in the middle. And then you can take this whole table and move it inside and out and, and, and be able to use it outside too. Where the post tables that like a lot of manufacturers have, they, you can't move those to the outside. So that's a plus. Uh, they do have cabinets up top um, all the way through the whole slide out there. And again, you'll have roller shades and two windows as well. This does go down to a bed. So this table will fold down. Um, it'll sit right there in your grooves and then your cushions just lay perfectly in there to give you another spot for sleeping. All right, moving over to the bunks here. It does have the double over double bunks. Uh, you have a bottom one. Uh, it does have storage underneath the bottom one for, for extra storage down below. As you move up, you'll have a top bunk as well. It does have the nicer material on the bunk mats. They are a little bit thicker bunk mats too compared to a lot of them out there. So um, adults can sleep in these a lot easier. Uh, that's one big plus where a lot of them are really um, don't have much width. These do have a lot more width and um, are, are more sturdy and, and give you a lot more room, room for, you know, and then even kids, you know, you, when you get a unit, you may have young kids and then over the years they grow, they get taller. Um, so now you've got, you, they're not going to outgrow them that way. Okay, moving into the bathroom, you're going to notice you've got a sink right when you walk in your door. It does have some nice shelves uh, for, you know, toothbrushes. You've got your um, storage up above there in your medicine cabinet. As you come down, then you're going to have your toilet down below. Uh, it does have plenty of space for, for your legs. And then you'll move into your shower. It does have a nice shower surround. And then down below, you're gonna notice this does have a shower miser. And what a shower miser does is it, it, it'll, it circulates the water and then that'll change colors so that you know when you've got hot water and you didn't just run your water for five minutes waiting for it to get hot and filling up all your holding tanks and that also conserves fresh water. As you come up top, you'll notice you've got a 10 blade fantastic fan, which does have a vent cover over top of it. So if you leave in the middle of the day, you don't have to worry about, you know, did it rain and I still have my vent open, it's got a cover over top so it keeps it if you're making a mess on the inside from, from raining. Again, my, my name is Mitch from RV Wholesalers again, and, and I appreciate you taking the time today to go through this Rockwood with me. Um, if you've got any questions at all, uh, give me a call. My direct line is 937-843-4380. I've been here almost 17 years now. You're looking at my favorite product in this Rockwood. I know all the products really well, so I'd love to help you out and answer all your questions, help find a floor plan that work best for you and your family. Um, I appreciate if you could like us on YouTube. Uh, we got tons of videos coming out on YouTube, on Facebook, on TikTok. So subscribe to everything. Uh, we, we do all free videos coming out every day. We partnered with Ohio State Buckeyes now, so we're doing pretty cool stuff with them as well. We've got rentals and everything that you do that you can you know rent the units and stuff like that as well. So um, any questions, we'd love to help you. Again, uh, this is RV Wholesalers in Lakeview, Ohio. Appreciate you taking the time. Thank you.